Hey everyone, welcome back to Sebrov. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix Minecraft launcher not downloading and installing on Minecraft. So on Windows 10 or Windows 11, if you're trying to download or install and nothing is happening, nothing is clicking, then what you have to do, you just need to apply four to five solution that I'm going to share in this video. And after that, you will find that the problem has been fixed. And if this works for you guys, and if you want that, you should get such kind of related videos related to gaming and Windows, then please consider subscribing to the channel and like the video. And if you have any issues, then let me know in the comment section. Now, first thing that what I recommend that please make sure that there is no update going on in the background. Many times on your Microsoft store, there are some updates which are updating application installed through the Microsoft Store. Just because of that, when you try to download or install any other application like Minecraft Launcher, it fails and nothing happens. Or you can check on your store on the very left hand corner, click on library. And then you will see all the app here and just check the status here. If they are updating, then you have to stop it or wait until the update has been completed. All right and also make sure that there is no other application is downloading all right once you are done and still if you have the issues then what you have to do just click on the profile icon at the right hand top and then go with sign out the sign out and after that sign in back again and see that if this fix the issues and if not then close it now the next thing what you need to assure that your date and time and region is up to date look at the right and bottom corner and you will see your date and time just match it if this is incorrect or if there is any kind of uh, differences just right click on it choose adjust date and time and here in the set date and time automatically make sure this is enabled this will automatically detect the time according to your zone and the same you have to do like with your time zone choose the right time zone and also go with other settings like language and region choose the right region choose the right language you can also select here country or region so just assure that everything is correct and according to your location once you are done close it now on your windows 11 or 10 click on the search box and type here trouble and from the suggestion choose troubleshoot settings click on other troubleshooter now scroll down to microsoft store and here you will find windows store apps on the very right of it you will find run click on run this will start detecting the problem and let you know that what exactly the problem is so if it detected it's fine we will just wait and see that what solution or what kind of recommendation we get it from here and now it says troubleshooting could it identify the problem so if you get the same message no need to worry you can close it but if you get any recommendation then follow the steps you can now close it close everything and now right click on the windows icon choose settings now here look for the storage on windows 10 probably you will see on the left hand menu option click on storage and then it will show you that what kind of a space is occupied. You have to look for this temporary file here. So click on temporary file. And then you have to select all these options. If you want to clear your recycle bin, you can check that option. And this says previous windows installation. If you want to delete it, kindly go ahead and delete it. I would recommend that you should delete the previous windows. Then you will get download. If you want to empty download, you can check this option as well. And once you are done, click on remove files, then click on continue. And once it's been done, you can close it. Again, right click on the windows icon, then click on settings. Now from the left hand side, click on apps, then click on apps and features. Here in the search box, type store. Then on the right side of the Microsoft Store, you will see the three dot. Click on it, then click Advanced Options. Now scroll down and click on Reset. 
click reset again and wait until this is completed once done close it again click on the search box type here ws reset then choose run as administrator and this will clear the cache of the microsoft store and it will automatically come up now once this come up again click on the search box look for minecraft launcher and then click on install and see if this works or not okay so on my end it, it seems to be working and but still if you have the issues then what you have to do next just right click on the windows icon and choose windows terminal admin click on it then click on yes and now you will be getting a command in the description you need to copy the command come to this box make a right click and it will be pasted then hit on enter wait until the process has been completed and once done restart your computer and again open your microsoft store and check if the problem has been fixed i'm very sure that these all troubleshooting steps will surely resolve the problem of microsoft store not downloading or not installing minecraft launcher or any other application so that's all guys for today hopefully this short video will help you and if yes consider subscribing to the channel like the video and please do not forget to comment if you, still if you have any issues and problems till then take care bye bye